Alright, what up you guys? Gabe here. Now, outside my house, and I have some golf news that I want to bring to the attention to you of, okay? Now, this golf news is that Stevie Williams, or Steve Williams, Tiger Woods' caddy has gotten sacked. Now, what I mean by getting sacked is that they weren't playing football, Stevie Williams would hut hut and Tiger Woods sacked him. No, that's not what I mean. I mean Steve Williams got canned. And once again, by getting canned, I don't mean that Tiger Woods had an unusually large cylinder tin can and put Stevie Williams in it. I mean Steve Williams got fired like the Donald Trump you fired. Now, honestly, if you've done a little bit of reading on Steve Williams, which I have done just a tiny bit myself, Steve Williams was regarded as being the best caddy alive, basically just how Tiger Woods was known as being the best golfer. So, I mean, they were a team, they were together. And there's a lot of speculation on why Tiger Woods left Steve. But either way, it's some pretty big golf news. Um, Steve Williams has been catting for Adam Scott, I believe, the last four or five tournaments. But most people believe this all started when uh, the whole Tiger Woods and his wife incident started. Um, I heard Steve Williams' wife and Tiger Woods' wife were great friends. So I think that's when the whole awkward situation started. But anyways, I wanted to know what you think about Tiger Woods firing Steve and what caddies he might go to, and how do you think Steve's going to do? Uh, maybe he might stick with Adam Scott, I don't know. Leave a comment section below. Uh, yeah, leave a comment in the comment section below. Let me know what you think about that. Anyways, I'm just going to show you guys some footage I took from the golf course the other day, just playing some golf with some friends. Hope you enjoy. Hit me up on Facebook. Subscribe if you like the vids. Thanks, you guys. Talk to you soon. Peace. All right, what up, you guys? Here we are over here at Arrowwood Golf Course, playing with a few buddies. As you know myself, uh, the best looking out of the group as usual. Now here we got my boy Tyler. You know. He's just tour driven golf as you can see. He has the t-shirt on. Represent. All right, too legit. <laughs> my boy Chris who uh, works here is getting us all on for free so thanks to him. Zane, the main, he's over here. Wants, he's like pointing him to get the camera on him so Turn I'm like, Batman. all right, <laughs> cool, cool. My boy Austin, the bossin, he's the boss around this place. He just kind of regulates, follows the group. <laughs> Score. Um, yeah, so we're on hole seven here, just having a good day, and just maybe film a little bit of golf for you guys. My boy Chris, it's a uh, 367 yard par four. He's gonna lay up with an iron, because that's just how he rolls. Should be money right down the left side. All right, Tyler with a three wood, Tyler? Yep. Three wood, it's a good Taylor made R9. Old school. Yeah, a little right, but we'll be able to find that. Austin, he kind of, he is the manager around here. He kind of tells us what to do and when to do it. Rocking the uh, Adidas, loving it. R11, of course. Money. That was solid. Not the most conventional swing, but he gets it done right down the middle every time. All right, my boy Zane, he plays with the black ball because he's G like that, matching uh, his clothes, of course. He's very oriented. Money! I think he killed a bunny. He killed a bunny! Oh, wow. That's all right. It's good to go. All right, Chris. About 150 pins in the middle. There's the 150 flag right next to him. Yeah, it looks good. It's right side of the green. Using some uh, tailor-made smoke irons. Not bad. All right, here's Tyler's shot. About 115, as you can see, is a blind shot. It's got to hit over these trees. Got to do like a Tiger Woods up in the air. He gets it over. It's looking good. It's well contact. We'll see where it ends up. Can't see the green from here. All right, there's the 100 yard marker. Yeah, that, that's the thing about people playing with me. They got to keep the camera on. Is it recording right now? Or? Yeah, it's recording. All right, there's Zane's putt, and it's a little bit short. That's solid there. Go. There's Austin up there just chilling like a G, making sure everyone's doing what they need to do. There's Chris's putt coming into frame, and not bad, about two feet away. Good putt. All right, Tyler's first par. Oh. Whoa! <laughs> and that's uh, 
little player uh, <laughs> you know how sportsmanship <laughs> right there. I think it was going. Okay, this is Zane. <laughs> this is for a 24. <laughs> Over par. It was not going to be under par. <laughs> Money. Damn. Oh. It's all right. Tap in for 25. Oh, oh man. <laughs> this guy's good with the ball right there. Par three. Number eight. Can't really tell who's hitting right now. I think it might be Chris. Oh my God. Come on. Come on. Oh. <laughs> All right, there's Tyler. He's got a little kind of a flop shot. Pins right there. Got, got a little bit of green to work with. Not bad there, about nine feet for par. Should give it a chance. Did you let them know the greens are half punched over here? <laughs> nope. <laughs> <laughs> Tyler is funny. <clears throat> this one for Birdie. Tap in for par. <laughs> Definitely not on the women's soccer team. <laughs> Blacked out a tire, putting from the rough. Not bad. All right, here's Tyler. Oh, oh that's dirty. a dirty robbery lip out right there. All right, so this is the hole we just played. There's the tee box way over there in the back right. 190 yard par three. My boy Cirillo hit a five iron. Um, just flushed it right at the pin. Got about eight feet. Eight and a half feet for birdie, looking up the hill. Get in the hole! One time. Oh, looks like I hit the edge. Nah, good par on a hard hole. All right, hole nine here, par five, coming out with the big dog. Money. It's a good shot. Tyler with the R11 as well. Yeah, started left, but fading back should be good. Oh yeah, Rudy. They're oh, saying, yeah, oh, yeah. "Oh yeah, get Ooh, some, baby." Yeah, All right, Austin. Snap back. Boom. Oh, right down the Keep it, middle. keep it, baby. All day, every. Three wood from about 350. Just in the first cut of rough here. Gonna take a rip of the green. Spank the monkey. Wow, that's look that's right at the pin. Be good. Oh my oh, a little short, but it'll work. Good shot. Alright, there's Zane and uh, ball could go anywhere when he's hitting just beginner. Better put this up. Windshield. Right. Not that bad. He's hit two shots right down the gut. Good shot, Zane. PT. Looks like uh, Chris is playing with the old Titleist or Titleist as he likes to call it. PT Vintage right there. These things are clean. I actually really like this clubs. I used to have one. You gotta be a good player to hit this though. Rocking the R11 driver. Or glove I mean. About 265 uphill. That's look good. Just around the right side of the green. Kick left. Uh, a little short not bad. That's on the green. Great shot man. Cut! Cut, ball! All uh, four carts in the fairway here. Just having a good, just having a good, good time hanging with the buddies. All right, there's the pin. There's Zach. He's about 25 yards short of the green. Ooh, not bad. He didn't have much green to work with though. 15 feet for his birdie. 
There's Chris. He doesn't have too hard of a chip right here. Probably a little bit of upslope should help. Mm, not bad, about five feet. Zane, always putting. And he's bunk. Tiger Woods fist bump coming if he makes it. Which he will, because he always does. One time, oh, just burning the edges all day. All right, Chris, he's thinking inside right, downhill. Just got to get a good line on it. He hit it right on his line and made it. Oh, nice bird. That's an epic 62. Once again, we like to bring the pro out here once in a while. <laughs> Oh, and that's for a round of a 63 heartbreaking loss to Zane Michael. <laughs> <laughs> next time, next time, Gabe. <laughs> Sorry. Sounded solid. Nice. Good ball, right down center. Thanks. Well, play, play, play. Professional yeah. style. Good shot, man. Tyler is hitting first. Not sure. There it is, right there. He's right over here, a little chip and put, and that's it. You guys, I'm, I'm eating some tiger smoke right here. Charlie Sheen might have tiger's blood, but I got Tyler's tiger's milk, which is just as good. <laughs> Charlie. Yeah, Charlie Sheen got nothing on me. I've got tiger's milk. I mean, if you're consuming anything that was coming from a tiger, it's gonna be pretty gangster. You're gonna be a beast. I mean, I've had tiger's paw before, the tiger's nail. I mean, it works. Chris with a drive. Oh, great drive. Where'd it go? A little right? Oh, no. All right, here's Tyler, three wood. Looking for position. Dog leg right, and... Yeah, the match is the smooth. Though. That'll be all right. Might be spread over that fairy bunker, not too bad. Is it reachable, that bunker? All right, there's Tyler's ball in the fairway bunker here. What do you got to the pin, Tyler? 155 and what club is that for you? Eight. Eight iron, okay. He's gotta kind of go over this ravine, this chasm right there, and then there's the green on the other side. Looks like a back pin. But he's got a clear look and a nice little angle at the green. Let's see if you can just pick it nice and clean out here, dig his feet in for balance and stability. Oh, super clean right at the pin. That was a great shot. Oh, solid pin high. Good shot, Tyler. All right, Cirillo so says he's thinking left edge. Got the Odyssey white hot here. Back and through. Oh, center every time. It's that easy. It's that easy, he says. And that's a bird. Nice birdie. To maintain. And this is for Tyler for birdie. They both uh, stiffed it in here. I just two putted for par. Oh, 
Looking good. And two birdies. I feel left out. Nice job.